Rocket Docs 2.0 now has an autofill feature that allows you to automatically insert multiple answers into an RFP the first time you open it. Let me show you how. First, I have to create a project, so I have to type in a little bit of information including selecting a project type. That allows you to have a specific workflow based on whether it's an RFP, a security document, or whatever kind of questionnaire it is. I'll type in the name of the client. Uh, and I'll go ahead and hit next. Uh, what I now have the opportunity to do is to upload the RFP. So first I'm going to select an RFP to upload. <clears throat> and once I do, I have a couple of different options available what to do with it. Both of them include parsing. When I check either box, what's going to happen is the RFP will run through our artificial intelligence capability to identify the questions in the RFP. So we'll automatically extract the questions that you need to respond to. The second thing it'll do is it'll compare the questions that we just found in this RFP to questions existing in our database and they'll look to see if there's any matching uh, where we have questions that mean the same thing as the questions in the RFP. We use NLP or natural language processing to evaluate and do that comparison based on the meaning of the questions not just a word matching. The third thing it'll do is it'll look at the meaning of the questions again in the RFP but compare them to the answers in the database and ultimately it'll find the highest confidence match. Uh, so what is the best possible answer for the questions that we found in this RFP? Um, of course that high confidence has to be of a certain minimum threshold. So once I hit check that button and hit next, by checking the field that I did it's going to go through that parsing and uh, question answer matching. It will also then automatically insert the answers into the question. So you'll see, first I go through the parsing. Now you'll see it identified seven questions in this very simple RFP. Six of them had answer matches and six of them got inserted. So if I go right now into the RFP, you'll see I have a, um, an actual report here as well. And as I scroll through, you'll note that here are questions that were identified and automatically answers that were inserted questions that were identified and answers that were inserted. Anywhere where I do not have an answer inserted, you'll see please insert your answer here. So we didn't capture them all, but it does a pretty good job of creating much more efficient first pass on an RFP.